Hey, what's up, guys? So this is my third video about stochastic calculus, and hopefully, uh, today, so we will use the uh, Ito's formula again and solve another uh, stochastic uh, differential equation. Okay, so what stochastic equation? Uh, the what uh, Ito's formula is very powerful is that uh, somebody give you uh, dx t mu t dt plus sigma uh, dwt or sigma t dwt. And uh, you can compute df to be the partial df plus mu uh, sigma uh, derivative x f and then plus half of sigma square uh, partial x f dt. And that is also this term. Okay. And the previous then previous video that uh, one can I can solve the uh, the geometric I can solve the geometric uh, Brownian motion right for I can solve dx equal to let's say uh, sigma x uh, dwt plus mu uh, x uh, dwt. So d t d t okay, and the uh, the way I can solve this is that I introduce f to be log x, and I do the differential. Okay, so I just plug f to be log x and uh, play around with the uh, Ito's formula, and I get very weird. I get very beautiful results. I just get f d f to be something. Uh, pure. there's no no uh x dependence, and uh, there's no x dependence for d w t. Then I can just write my results f to be f zero plus let's say something. Uh, d s and then for t zero, and also uh d w t for uh d d w s for like t zero, something here. Okay, so this is the standard trick. Okay, so now uh we will if you haven't seen my previous video, you can check out. So in this video, we play around with this model. So I will not pronounce it because I'm not sure whether my pronunciation is correct. So in this case, that d x t is a minus b a x t d t plus c uh, d w t. Okay, and I'll solve xt. Okay, so the, the trick is that we have defined f to be exponential btx. Now we need to plug this f into this uh, this one. Okay, so before we do this, we should like uh, make a table right, to make everything clear. So the f is this. What about the derivative, uh, derivative on t? So we get b exponential btx. What about the uh, partial xf? We get the exponential bt. What about second derivative? We got a zero. Okay, and the mu is mu is this, right? So it's mu is a minus b t, and the sigma is c. Okay, so we got the f equals to a uh, tie derivative b exponential b t x plus a minus b t. Uh, the mu right partial x f is is point of bt, and uh, sorry this is bx, b a minus bx yeah right? plus plus zero okay, dt plus c d omega t. Okay, now uh this is a trick right this is why we choose this, so you can see oh my god these two turn cancel okay so if df will be a exponential b t oh uh oh, sorry, I forget about uh, partial x f right so there should be another uh, exponential b t here so I guess c exponential b t d w t okay because I forget this term okay so this is this okay so now we can solve this right because now uh the right hand side doesn't contain x okay so let's go here. So we get our df. Uh, remember this df is exponential b t x. Okay, equals to a exponential b t d t plus c exponential b t d w t. Okay, so now we just do the integral. So we get exponential b t x integral with a exponential b t d t. Now we need to use the dummy variable. Okay, hopefully this is simple to you. We use dummy variable, okay, so s, s, zero, t, plus c exponential b, s, d, w, s, and then it's Brownian motion, right? So probably this integral cannot be exactly compute. So zero t plus x zero. Okay, so let's just, just call this dummy term x zero. Okay, so now we can solve our x to be uh, x zero exponential negative b, t, plus Zero T C is exponential B S D W S exponential B T negative B T. Now uh what about this term? Plus A. Okay, so this term is very simple, it's exponential B S D S zero T 
will be just whatever b is potential uh b t minus one. All right, hopefully it's correct. Okay, so it's a e times a divided by b exponential b t minus one. Okay, this is the final results. Uh, uh, sorry. Uh, so, so I need to you need to times this. So you need to times a negative b t here. Okay, exponential negative b t right because here once once you do the integration you need to times this. Okay, so uh usually you can combine these two right. So you combine these two. Oh. You got one minus exponential negative bt. Okay, once you have this, then you just yeah plug this into this. Okay, so uh yeah, I think this is the correct answer. And uh yeah, so this is the result. So you now you you can see your x is a st stochastic process with some uh Brownian motion. So integral of Brownian motion is also still stochastic process, right? So it's like that's it. And by the way, that uh, let's one how about let's do the sanity check. Okay, so let's do the sanity check. So sanity check go back to your on undergrad ODE, right? So we just plot, let me just put C to be zero. Okay, so when C equals to zero, then I get X equals X zero exponential negative BT plus A divided by B one minus exponential negative BT. And uh, you can easily prove this is correct. Okay, the reason is that uh, you can go back to solve this differential equation exactly. Okay, so the way to do this is that we, we already know that our dx is a minus bx d t, right? So this can be easily solved, right? Because this is separable differential equation. So I can just do the integration. Okay. Okay, so I don't want to do this, but you can easily check this is, uh, this is very simple, right? Because you can do this, this is just log of a minus bx negative b, uh, equals to t minus t zero, and uh, if you don't do this, let's say we just write a t, and then let's say uh, we can just add some constant here. Let's say constant is terms called c bar here, and then you can just do you can just write down your calculation, right? You just times b here and uh, move it. Then you will get the exactly the same expression as here. Uh, just forget about this. Uh, this. Uh, differential at uh, this stochastic term. Okay, so uh, yeah, so second be uh second example that uh, about this Ito's formula is of this weird model. Okay, and uh, this is whole calculation. And uh, next time we will do the third model, and uh, hopefully through this remodel that you know how to do this Ito's formula. Okay, hopefully.